Hello everyone, and thank you for joining me here. My name, of course, is Mr. Mocha Lover. Let's continue playing as that Russian SFSR. But right now, we're just taking a good look at the Proletariat Mutual Assistance Pack. So, um, I'm just taking a quick look to see who's in the Allies, who's not in any faction, and who's with us. So, obviously, as you can tell, most of Asia already is. We need to finish off the South Pacific, Madagascar, the rest of South America, which has actually gone a little better than I thought. And then, of course, North America. So, uh, right now, I've literally just started planning another naval invasion of Borneo, or the Kalimantan, and North Borneo. So, we're going to wrap up, hopefully, the former Dutch East Indies today. Keep moving, and maybe even invade Australia, and finish off the goddamn Philippines, because it's annoying fighting the Philippines. Uh, too many islands here. I would not want to live here. There's just too many islands, man. Too many islands. But, regardless... Oh, uh, I guess I'm trying to also navally invade whenever I could. So yeah, go ahead when you can. Um, yeah, actually I added, I made some extra subs and I decided to add them on here. So we are moving up in terms of sea tiles or sea zones. So we can maybe stop having the allies transport really the United States and Canada, Mexico. Stopping them from exporting goods this way through the Atlantic. Now they'll really have to come through the Pacific if they want export. But eventually we'll close off the Pacific as well. So that will be good. Also, Chile has been... Something has been weird. I mean, look at the the strength of my soldiers. Some of them are extremely weak. Or, you know, half strength. But um, but we've been doing actually pretty well. Not going to lie. Pretty darn well. And if you're wondering who I can annex, is just Brazil. And it's way too early for me to annex Brazil, so I'm not going to do that. Cool. Um, oh, 22 Central American, or really El Salvador convoys. Oh, we're also doing some con a lot of convoy raiding around here, too. Which is actually pretty good. So, awesome, awesome, awesome. And once we're doing the Philippines, yeah, we'll move down to the Java Sea, Australia, and take out a lot of these islands. Even though a lot of these islands are actually already under us, which is really cool. So we don't have to do that too much. So we'll get all this done, take out New Zealand, and then maybe navally invade South America from, from this way, perhaps if we need to, but also invade from into, you know, Alaska and whatnot too. Let's see, super heavy battleship hull. We're still making one of those. Battle cruiser, battle cruiser because of the BC. Um, I think I'm making two carriers. Yeah, I'm making two carriers. It'll be done in two years. So we might see them, we might not. We'll probably will see them, but someday, maybe. Awesome. And just go ahead when you guys can. I told the Mountaineers to go whenever they could, so. Oh, and there goes the Philippines. Thank God. Oof. That would be very annoying to do. We don't even have to need to invade. Great. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So go ahead and pause it real quick. Let's go ahead and gear up to invade Borneo. Shouldn't be too hard, honestly. It's only Borneo. Do they have a port up here? Maybe not. Just do one pretty, hopefully pretty quick invasion of this area. Come from here. Uh, invade there. Take these two. Uh, do I have this area? I don't have... Th um, we have this area. We have this area. So that's fine to go from here down to here. Yeah, that should be good. Come from that area to invade. Uh, that looks pretty good. A lot of places from the Philippines into here. Yeah, you can co probably come from down here to invade this area. That'll be good. And not just all these areas, because we should have enough soldiers coming here. Come from this area and invade this little island over here. Invade. Uh, probably from the same area. Davao. I guess that's how you pronounce it. Davao. To that port. Actually, just in case. Uh, we probably have too many soldiers down there. We'll do that area down to... Ooh, down here. Yeah, please. Thank you very much. Just snake your way everywhere, pretty much. That's what I really want. Uh, probably not here. I don't want to get into that sea zone just yet. Oh, actually, you could probably take Surabaya, perhaps? We got a lot of divisions that are navally invading, which is awesome. Um, but bum Yeah, also come from here to invade. Eh, if, you, if we don't have Jakarta by then, so be it, but whatever. Alright, give those guys some time to do whatever they need to do, as we are already beginning a naval invasion of Borneo. Great, and I'm still not going to put things in here because they still have ships and lot, probably lots of planes. So, 
Anything in South America? Well, these tanks don't have really good organization at the moment. Uh, maybe you guys need to redeploy or something? That does not look good. Nice. Yeah, send these guys to Hades. Awesome. Two British convoys. Oh, oh, hello, Germany. Good job. Nice. You actually landed on a port. Actually, there's Mexicans here, too. You actually landed on a port. And that was actually a pretty great idea. Yeah, can't really do much else there. Ah, uh, you know what? Just in case, I'll build up another port here as well. This helps suppress German autonomy gain. As well as just overall, just giving us more supply through here eventually. Good. Good job, guys. Uh, coast, I should be good on Coast Guards right now. They have a lot of supply in South America, so... It looks like the Danes are actually trying to attack as well. Interesting. They aren't really doing that well. But they kind of are. Nice. We're done with our naval doctrine now. Right? Yeah. Super heavy battle holes are done. Yeah, we're done here. Great. We're running out of things to research. Um, air. Oh, we still have a lot of air stuff we could do, but... Uh, that's two years away. That's probably not worth it. Engineering. Uh, sure. This will give us more motorized rocket artillery soft attack. Only 5% more, but... I'd rather take 5% than no 5%. Oh, and they are not going to win there. That's not good. Alright, very nice. Eh, build it up here too, because you never know if you want more supply through areas. It's always better to have more supply than you need than having not enough. Awesome, yeah, look at these... Co these uh, I guess these are... These are Republican submarinos. But we also have our boys over here too. Ah, oh, yes. The American convoy system must be... The Merchant Marine. Must not be doing so good if they got less than 700 convoys. Ooh, baby. Oh, yeah. Come on, Republican Spaniards, you're helping us out, and help, helping you out, actually. Ah, oh, another convoy lost. I love sub fours. Oh, ooh, planes. Attacking a screen group. Awesome. And we, in, we have landed already in Borneo. Great. So for you, some, go that direction, and are you guys ready to go? No, not really. You guys are still trying to get more organized and actually transporting to where you need to go. So give it a few more moments here. And actually, uh, we could probably take off the East China Sea. And I'm going to replace it with a Java Sea. Ah, uh, Java. I have a cup of Java right here. Well, black coffee. Whatever. Hmm, very nice. Very, very nice. Cool. Oh, yeah, we started doing... Oh, those Venezuelan boys. I'm so sorry. Not really, though. Oh, look at that battleship. Oh, so sexy. Oh, beautiful. God, I really... I don't know why, but... I really like the naval mechanics, kind of now. I don't, maybe I'm not really sure. I really like how they've developed the naval system. It can be like when you first start learning about the naval meta, which I don't exactly adhere to, just because I usually just play single player games. But it's I don't know. I think a lot of fun when you can just see how well you can do. Of course, this is against the AI, of course, but just I don't know. It's cool seeing battleships and battle cruisers and carriers and light cruisers just. Just go try to destroy everything in front of them. It's really kind of awesome. Ah, so good. Ah, the poor Dutch East Indies convoy. Didn't make it home. Ah, oh. well, made it home to the bottom of the sea. Oh, and we're going to take Jakarta anyways. We've begun a really disgusting, tentacly invasion of Pacific Islands. I mean, it just looks like a lot of tentacles that are slithering their way into... Uh, <laughs> Another man's land, but that sounds really weird. Holy cow. <laughs> that sounds really weird. But anyways, use your imagination on that one, kids. Or don't. Don't do that. Anyway, um, cool. Hmm. Hmm. I don't use armored cars. Supporting companies? Ah, I'll get some more police suppression. No, Nothing says peace like police suppression. Oh, baby. Go ahead and take this one. Oh, and we've start, begun taking these islands. Nice. Good. Just take one and just come all the way down. Slither, way, your, slither your way down here to down here to the air base. Because that will come in handy when we're going to invade uh, that one country called Australia. You guys invaded. Uh, nice. You, that's all you had to do. Cool. You four, just make your way around here. Have fun. Explore the island. Don't get bit by snakes or some guys who might be hiding in caves ready to shoot at you. I know it's a giant mess, but that's okay. That's why we love it. 
Cool. Just need more time. Just need time for them to take everything out. And we can actually win in Makassar, huh? Enemy air superiority. Oh. And regardless if the enemy had air superiority or not, we still won. Ah, oh, I love it. I love the Republic. The, so the Russian SFSR. Ah, oh, love it. Uh, yes, please. More close air support. Thank you very much. Yeah, go and take that stuff. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, Dutch East Indies. Actually, I didn't even check on their strength before we began this. Oh, is this a VOC? Is that what the flag is supposed to Oh, it is a VOC. Nice. That's like the colonial Dutch... I guess, basically Dutch East Indies. Six divisions, no ships, a few planes, no manpower. Or, I guess, a million manpower, I mean. Oh, a destroyer sunk. I love it. Uh, you guys could be doing something as well. Let's go right ahead. Uh, yeah. Alright, uh, I guess that wasn't good enough for you. Take that. You probably honestly don't even need to defend the port. I don't think the... Allies are going to show up here any moment here, so. Nice. Destroying a couple more ships. Great. Go ahead and take the airbase. And you just come over here to here to here to here to here. All the way down here to over there. Cool. And they have capitulated. Nice. Good job, guys. Great job. We need to these a couple more islands here. Let's see. You all. Honestly, you can just probably cancel everything you need to do. Let's immediately begin another invasion of the Dutch East Indies over here and this part of Australia. That probably would be for the best. Mostly because I think these guys have it in the bag. Go ahead and just take them all out. Take them all out, guys. Like, I will probably not even watch you guys do this as I'm looking at South America very soon. But let's go ahead and plan a few more naval invasions. Because that's pretty much the name of the game at the moment. Invade there. Invade from there again. Over here. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. You guys come from over here. Invade down there. And then invade from over here now to... Is there a port. I don't see a port on this side. Oh, there's a port right here. Yeah, take that. Come from here and invade. Oh, over here. That looks good. Take as much as you can from them. Leave them nothing. Eh, might as well try to take out that port. I don't know how strong the Australian army is. I can imagine it's not too weak, so... But you never know. You never know. I don't know that much about Australia. Oh, I forgot. Oh, crap. I forgot about that. Um, I said I was going to make... Oh, I might as well do this as well. I make a jungle division template, and I forgot about that. My apologies. I completely forgot about that. So, I will make that as soon as I'm done planning all these different types of naval invasions. So, yes, 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 yes. We're just, we're just finding so many convoys. Um, oh, you actually need to come from someplace, I guess? No? Alright, then. Come from here, then, and invade over here. And one more, one more. To invade... Sure, why not? Cool. Uh, take a quick look at everything here. Destroyer. Light cruisers. Eight Mexican convoys. Awesome. So I forgot about this. Let's go ahead and choose... We have jungle specialists. But can I use more of my Polish uh, divisions? And maybe duplicate them into... Thick... Pole... Jung. Thick jungle poles. Thick jungle poles. Yeah, there we go. Alright, go ahead and save that. Train you to become actual jungle specialist. Where you actually gain... That's 10% reliability, huh? You get more initiative as well. Huh, I did not know that. The quicker it can reinforce into battle and the quicker it gets its planning done. You get slightly less defense, more supply use, less HP, but... Okay then. Very interesting. I, I've never used these. Usually because I'm pretty lazy about my 
sometimes I'm lazy about my templates, but but once you know you're rolling into the war, you really don't want to concern yourself with and more templates that you have to work with. All right, very nice. Forty with Jungle Boys. Here we go. Um, uh, obviously it'll take some time to train these boys. So, yeah. Uh, for this, actually, it's just easier for me to train. You know what? We don't need this. I know it's almost done, but I really don't need that. I need this. I need thick jungle poles. Uh, I don't want to make some of my own just because I want to save on my manpower, but I will add four at a time and begin replacing some of our own soldiers with that. It looks like our allies are actually trying to expand out for for us. So that's actually really cool. Three, one, actually it's really three, plus three, plus three is sometimes nine, but nine sometimes can't win the battle. Uh, is there anywhere we could actually, oh, well, maybe here. Could we win here? No. No. Air superiority, even though we have it, still not that good. Still ain't that great. Give me another, uh... Actually, do we have any regular medium bomb or a jet a bo jet medium bombers? Oh, nice jungle two. Get, give it that jet tactical bomber one. Let's try that out. See how good these bad boys are. I'll just throw you onto some place here. Tanks, whatever. Um, four. Uh, you know what? You might actually win here. Get rid of one of you guys. Uh, and you might actually win. Yeah, cool. Great job, guys. Take all but one and attack this way as well. You actually won the battle. Nice. Yeah, I know, I know. Research slot available. More jungle boys. More organization. Very cool. Another plane been researched. Awesome. We lost a couple planes. That's fine. So be it. Uh, oh, whoops. Oh, yeah. Get this next one. Jet fighters, yes, please. That actually has really good range, so I'm actually probably switch pretty much almost all of my heavy fighter production. Not all of it, but most of it to actually probably all of it to jet fighters. That'd actually be really cool. Make your way over there. We'll finish that up. Immigrants have arrived. Yes, immigrants. I'm not sure where we get immigrants from, but we still get a lot of immigrants. Ah, oh, wow, we got 8.8 .8 million manpower. Wow. Holy cow. I love immigrants. I love them. You guys are planning the invasion. You're doing a, probably going to be doing a pretty good job. Uh, we need some naval invasion support. We can probably take this area off, actually, finally. And do the Timor Sea, which could be dangerous since Australia could bomb the hell out of that area. But let's see what happens. For you guys, South China Sea, we should be okay without needing to guard it. Because we will need the Bismarck Sea as well. And as well as this, so... Alright, concerning you guys, you are still... Where are you guys going? I'm going to just take a hubbub of you guys. Not you. Go ahead and come on down... To here. And do that. Take you two. Do here. To do... Bop, 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 bop. Good. Just go ahead when you can. Yeah, just go ahead when you can, man. Uh, they're going to be starving for supplies anyways. And someone wants to rebel against my rule. Italian Union. Guys, guys. I freed you from the clutches of fascism. Literally. Literally redeem you from fascism. I gave you almost all of your lands back. And you still want more autonomy. Come, no, no, no. I even let you kept Trieste and Istria. Istria. Come on, man. Yeah, I know I took your little Sardinia and stuff. I'll give it back to you eventually. No worries. No worries. Just... Don't do that. Actually, what's the military capabilities of Australia? Alright, manpower isn't great. Holy cow, they only have seven divisions. That's kind of insane to think about. I think they'd have at least 20. To at least defend the homeland. We sunk 23 American convoys. That's awesome. And, oh my goodness. Ah, more Americans. I mean, just look at that. Look at all those light guns. Look at those torpedoes. Look at that fleet anti-air and those depth charges. Ah. Nothing can just compete against the power of the Russian SFSR. Nothing can. 
and you guys look pretty good to go. Go ahead and snake your way into those little booty holes. Off we go. Ooh, two American destroyers, nice. Two more American destroyers, Canadian destroyer. South America's been pretty, pretty quiet. As we slowly, slowly try to sneak up through Chile. This does not look good. I don't want to send tanks in that way, that would be very bad. I'll send that tank though. Could you attack here and win? No. Alright, well, that was a very quick battle. Four divisions. Convert you guys to mountaineers, perhaps. Immediately. Not very strong soldiers, but yeah, they're still soldiers. Take you off. Take these four. And you guys might need a little bit more strength. They cancel the lend lease, so be it. Whatever. Gotta love coffee. Ah, very good. These guys are lacking organization, but they might be pretty strong here. Oh, maybe not. Actually, switching to Mountaineers probably was a good idea. Actually, a really good idea. Such a fighting in Chile. We've landed down here. And the supply is what we would call garbage tier. So, um, come down here. And maybe try to snake your way over to over here. Where else have we landed? Like, oh, we liberated this area for the Portuguese. Very nice. Very nice. Awesome. You guys did a great job. And the Coast Guards are moving right in. Love it. I could already go ahead and try to figure out a, some sort of uh, naval invasion of Australia. They only have seven divisions, so actually it's probably not a bad idea to do this. Uh, not you. Come from here, and they have a port over here. Do that. Good luck. You, you might need it. You might actually need it. You guys, come on around here. And more... Ah, immigrants. Love it. Go ahead and do that when you can. You guys just make it to the supply base. And maybe come back this way. You guys are trying to wrap up down here. Very nice. Just make your way down there. I don't think anyone's really going to hate you for that. Nice. Advanced rocket engines. Very good. Ooh, we get V3 rockets. Guided missiles. Nice. And let's get the next one. We're even 5% more attack. Oh, we sunk a destroyer. Great. Destroyer. Two destroyers. Another destroyer. Two destroyers. Oh, baby. Sounds deadly. They're going to end monarchism? Guys, guys, I don't think you're in a position to really end one of your allies. That doesn't make any sense. They got less than 600 convoys now. Less than probably 40 ships. A lot of divisions. A lot of manpower, but... You're going to end monarchism. Shatter the empires. Oh my goodness, there goes another little fleet. Oh, good. Love it. Oh, we found another little small little task force. Not a fleet, but it's a task force with, supported by Hungarian planes. We got three battleships, all from 1940-ish. Great. I love it when a plan comes together. It's so great. Oh, it's an Australian division. Nice. Oh, we lost four Hungarian planes, but we sunk 11 enemy ships. Love it. Oh, oh! Our allies actually took Bermuda. Oh, the Italians did. Good job, guys. Uh, well, only level 1 radar here. Well, it's better than nothing. Go ahead and put a lot of supply through here, because I can already tell the uh, my allies are probably going to put a lot of people on here so that we can invade North America. Uh, our allies have almost been pushed out of Venezuela, but we're still doing okay. Still doing okay there. Chile, not doing too bad now, actually. Um, our guys have more than enough supply, which is good. Take these two, take these three, attack here, but take another two divisions to help attack as well. Very good, very good. Ah, another mechanized division. Um, where are you under here? Where are you at? You are suffering from supply. Let's get rid of you for now. That might help supply for now. And actually add another, another person in there soon. That'd be great. They're wasting their manpower, their supplies on that group. South America is literally just a distraction for me to invade North America. Uh, see, the, the Americans don't realize that this was the game was rigged from the start. It always has been. Um, yeah, guys, just go on to there. That would be great. Oh, we found some Australian divisions. Oh, we actually found some. Oh, you guys come down here. Come through here. Come all the way down to this little stupid little part here. 
Um, thank you. Oh, there's a port right there. All right. Very nice. I don't know how they're actually still in my lands, and oh, they're just defeated. Okay. I probably literally have no like no will to live now. And just in case these guys need a little bit of supply, put a little port right there for them. Just takes some time to conquer all these stupid little places. That's all it takes. Just a little bit of time. All right, so you guys are done. Cool. Uh, uh oh, baby, we found some planes around here. All right, so I'm gonna actually turn these guys loose, and you guys will actually invade Australia proper. You'll be the main army that invades Australia. Obviously, I want at least one group to come from here. Let's actually make it a little bit shorter times from invading. Invade over there. Invade from here to here. God, I can't believe I'm already almost 26 minutes into this video. Jesus. Ugh, you know you enjoy something so much when you just lose track of time. Ridiculous. Cool. Do this. Come over here. This, invade this direction. Yeah, I know when we land, the supply is going to be absolutely terrible, but eh, it's Australia. What do you expect? Uh, you can come from here, probably. Invade down here. Shouldn't be doing it like this, but whatever. I don't really care. And invade that island. Cool. Uh, actually, you didn't invade that island. Come from there, and then invade. Okay, good enough. Yeah, we're missing this guy, but whatever. Very nice. And our... Oh, our boys are already begun the invasion of Australia. Very nice, very nice. And they've landed. Great job, guys. I knew I could trust you guys. Cancel their Lenly, so be it. I want you to just go ahead. Go ahead when you can, too. Uh, yeah. Oh, baby. They probably got quite a few planes around here. Ooh, 10 light cruisers, Jesus. Uh, where... I mean, I guess we have all the islands around here, I suppose, but, uh... Yeah, we could probably use a few more... Heavy fighters on this little... Air tile. That would probably actually help quite a bit. Help quite a bit. And... They're almost there. Nice. That should really quite help relieve some pressure off of our soldiers. We're trying to navally invade. Nice. Convoys. Uh, the attack for Venezuela has ramped up quite a bit. Huh. Alright, well, whatever. Uh, what are you doing over here? Hmm. Take all but one of you guys. Take you two. Attack destruction. We might win, maybe? Yeah, we did. Nice. Cool. Good job. Seven. Yeah, we're encountering some pretty heavy resistance. I'm training you guys to become Mountaineers as well, though. That will be good. Yeah, that should be very, very good. Jungle Specialist, honestly, should be converted over here. You guys are here. Go ahead and switch to Jungle Specialists. We'll actually gain a lot of material. Nice. That'll actually probably help quite a bit, especially if we're fighting in the jungle, so... Almost done with my coffee here. Hmm. Very good. Pretty bueno. Not gonna lie. Pretty bueno. Uh, does someone else want to rebel? Ah, Rom Romania. Why Romania? Just because I want everything that you have doesn't mean you have to rebel against me, man. Is that? Oh, that's Bulgaria, but we'll do that anyways. Uh, they can't really fit too much else in here. I'll give them more oil, I guess. Hmm, ooh. Convoys, yeah, they're all getting sunk. Ah, oh, it's looking beautiful. Isn't it beautiful, guys? It's so beautiful. Oh, we lost a convoy. That's not good. Um, hmm, no, 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 bum, bum, bum. We're pretty much done with this page. Oh, we're... Yeah, we can't do anything on the right. We did everything on the left. E.T., 1854. Oh, a better drop tank would be good. Nice. Uh, Australian light cruiser sunk. Very cool. Light cruiser sunk. Convoy sunk. Two more convoys sunk. Great. Uh, go ahead and just do go that way. You're probably not really needed on the other side of the world there. Just go and do this. 
No problems, no worries. We've landed very successfully. Just go ahead and stop doing all this then. I'm going to need the entire army down here to do this. All the way down. Even try to walk across to Tasmania. Tas Tasmania. And do that. Very good. Very, very good. Nice. Not much manpower left. I got five divisions. A couple more islands we got to take around here. Then take out New Zealand. Probably next time. Take out Pearl Harbor next time. And probably even invade. begin the invasion of Alaska in the next video. That's going to be awesome. Oh, we took out a Chilean heavy cruiser. A very cool. Very, very cool. Take you for Take this. Attack here. Actually, send the tank. We can that direction as well. Well, the, technically the Marines, but whatever. Um, yeah, Denmark hasn't been doing very much down here. They can't really do very much. Uh, before we end the video, though, torpedo bombers, jet tactical bombers. Let's add some of these bad boys onto here. They can do all this stuff. Oh, actually, add them over here. They could probably use it. Do I have anything else? Heavy fighter bomber twos, dive bombers, heavy bombers. Uh. Add, throw some more on there, why not? And then... We still got some more room. I don't see it. I don't think I see any... Oh, maybe I haven't switched over to heavy jet fighters yet. Oh, maybe that's probably why. I don't see any jet fighters. Well, it's because you didn't put any on production, Mr. Mocha Lover. Yeah, yeah, I know. Cool, 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 and good. Uh, let's see. Fighters... Jet heavy bombers, 15 of those. Medium bombers, much less than regulars. Oh, jet tactical bomber twos, we need that. Uh, we need jet tactical bomber threes, and that's when I'll upgrade stuff. Yeah, carrier fighters, heavy fighters. Go ahead and start making some jet fighter ones. I'm going to take most of the heavy fighter things off, since I don't think we'll ever run out of heavy fighters. I could be wrong. Leave them on 20. Still making quite a decent number of them, and that should be pretty good overall. Alright, you guys. No, not you guys. You all are this guy. The one on the right really should do this and do that. Just to finish these guys up. Go ahead and do that, but I want you to come over here. Take out this port. We got some more islands over there to take out, but that'll be fine. Uh, the enemy's gonna lose a lot of planes anyways. They're gonna lose their air bases, they're gonna lose their lives. I mean, that's probably the most important thing. Awesome. Oh, someone canceled probably some lend lease with me, whatever. Oh, nice. Another Chilean heavy cruiser sunk. Overall, I think the tide is really turning to the point where we can slowly inch our way towards more Chilean lands. Oh my goodness, more convoys. I love it. Ah, oh, this, is, this is, I think, going pretty darn well at this point now. I think we've pretty much solidified that. Oh, we did an encirclement. Except that they still have the port over there. That's not good. Um, we need a breakthrough here. Can you three do this? I doubt it. Yeah, I, d I didn't think you could actually do that. Hmm. We did cut them off, though. That's kind of nice. But we could push in a little bit harder. Just going that way. Uh, you guys will just might as well go in this way as well. Oh, maybe not. Oh, the Japanese have arrived. Nice. They brought in their tanks, and they brought in some divisions. Cool. So, that's pretty much all the time for we have today, guys. We've done pretty darn well, honestly. Uh, oh, actually, let's do this one, too. We've begun... The, we've taken out the Philippines. Finished off most of the Pacific Islands. Not all of them, but most of them. We finished off New Guinea, or was it Papau and Guinea? West Papau? We've already decided to invade Australia. So, I mean, we're going at a pretty good pace here. Once Australia's done, next time we'll go with New Zealand, pretty much the rest of the Pacific Islands, and then probably even begin the naval invasion of Alaska and Canada and the West Coast. Maybe even invade Mexico from our Pacific holdings. But until then, guys, thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate you guys when you come around and watch my videos. Uh, subscribe if you're new, like the video if you like the video, and I will see you tomorrow as we further the cause of the proletariat. Thank you very much for watching.